Hello everyone, Gavin Moves again and uh, today we are going to learn how to make this fantastic um, glitch effects in Spine uh, only using one image. Uh, we will have three different levels, like this one is the first one, very easy, easy one. The second one has some complicated things and the third one is is the most uh, complicated and most beautiful one uh, so let's get started okay so let's get our coin here let's center it okay so for the first effect that uh, we want to make uh, this one huh? um, uh, we just need to separate three color levels um, uh, red, blue, green uh, for the image so we can um, pos uh, position them um, so we can move them and uh, have this cool effect this one is very easy one so just um, duplicating just duplicating each one and uh, so this is the bottom now huh? I think Yes, uh, this is the bottom coin. I like to make the bottom coin um, red. Oh, sorry, I like to bottom coin red. So we are deleting this uh, green and blue from this layer, and uh, from this one we are removing red and uh, blue, and from this one we are leaving just the blue one. Mm -hmm. So now you see that uh, we have this three colors how to blend them to have the uh, the image that we we have so just the top two the top images just top images make them screen and here we have uh, the same image huh so you can see here the same one mm -hmm. just delete this one mm -hmm. okay so what what's left just make some bones for each one and mm, let's for having a good visual for the colors let's uh, color the oops let's color the bones this one red this one blue uh -huh. okay let's color the bone so we can understand which color we are moving this is green and this is blue okay oh uh -huh. that's it mm -hmm. so we're going to animate mode some people ask me uh, how you are shifting to animate mode without clicking here setup animate just click uh, control and tab so uh, to switch the modes okay okay let's go forward so here let's just keep the translate here and for example here so going forward with R key two frames and let's start the animate them uh -huh. Animate as you wish. How glitch will work? Don't uh, overthink it. It's it's glitch. Uh -huh. For the last position, we just copy paste this here. So here, this is very smooth. You see, just. Make them hold, uh, um, make keyframes hold. Huh? I don't know how it is uh, here. In After Effects, it's called hold keyframe. So, uh -huh. and here we have our cool. Mm -hmm. You see, this part I don't like. This part green is too much here. Let's move it this time here. Why it is always here? I think this is this looks cool. So this is the first one that I wanted to show you how to make the glitch effect. This is easy one and it will take like two three minutes of your time. So let's get 
to the next one. Next one is this one. Yeah. So you see here we have some cut it layers and here you can see that I've uh, meshed them. It will not over complicate the project file because each image just have um, four vertices so it will not uh, overheat huh? the computer, the PCs, etc. So um, let's make this one. Huh? Let's just delete this. Mm -hmm. Get ref coin again. Mm -hmm. So here we just go and let's just pre-bone this. We go and mesh it. So for edit mesh. Mm -hmm. And stop duplicate it for uh, for not messing up with the connections. Just uh, move down the top one each time. Oops, edit mesh and move down the top one. Okay, yeah, here we go. Okay, we have uh, thirteen. We have 13 layers here, so uh, let's make bones for each one. Let's make a bones for each one. Just click all of them, create new bones. Okay, so here. So now we have, uh, we can uh, move them separately. Let's go to animate them. So again. Try not to move in a uh, Y position. Keep it, oops, keep it in X. All, all when you are moving, you can keep it all in Y or all in X. But uh, messing with them, it will not good, look good. I think you can try it. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, I will fast forward this for not boring you too much. Okay, I think we have what we want. Just copy and paste the last ones. So, as the last time, we're making a hold keyframes. So, mm -hmm. I think that looks cool. Huh? What do you think? Yes, it uh, needs some time, uh, some time to make it, but I think uh, it's worth the price. Huh? The, it's worth the effort <coughs> to have this kind of glitch effect in your project. Okay, that's it. Now let's go to our the final and the coolest one. Um, here, this one. When we are uh, col uh, collaborating, um, we are using the both things that we have learned right now. So, uh, separating the, la the colors and the la uh, layered, uh, cut it, uh, coin. Huh? Sorry for my English. Okay, now so let's duplicate this last one so we can uh, we will not uh, recut the images huh so let's duplicate these ones mm -hmm. the, the first one you remember I like the red one to be in the bottom second one is the green and the top one will be blue mm -hmm. So let's and let's color let's color the bones. Now let's 
color the layers so here we have the blue ones so blue ones mm -hmm. delete all except the blue okay we have the blue one green red blue goes to zero and final the red one <laughs> that's it so as you remember we have to uh, make the top ones blending mode as screen bl in screen blending mode That's it. Oof. So, going back to animate mode. Oh, let's make this one again. All the images. Hello. This way. Red. This way. And all of them a little bit buttoned so we can animate. Okay. Let's start again. Translate, translate, why we have this? Uh -huh. So we have this, okay, but we are going to have some fun here. Oops, okay, red, green, blue, to frame ahead, green, red, blue. Again, you can see there are some smooth movements in the colors. Huh? Let's check them and make hold. Mm -hmm. That's it. Mm -hmm. Here are all three animations. The sample one just need three le three slots. The second one needs a lot as <laughs> you would wish. Huh? and some cutting and the third final cool one okay that's it i think and i hope you will like it i never seen something like this and if you have ever seen like this uh, animations or tutorials like this please comment below and <coughs> let me know what do you think about this and will you use this please please uh, like this video if you like it because I see um, how it uh, it's helping me huh? how it motivates me to make a new videos and um, take some time to make this kind of stuff okay like subscribe and um, we'll see next week I hope um, I am trying to make some UI animations, some UI tricks um, that may be helpful for you. Okay, thank you very much for your time. Bye bye. It's time to rev up the hype train, dear viewer. Your childhood memories are getting a reboot. Nostalgia.